everyone today's hearthstone mercenary comp is the murlocs we got mutinous varden and murkai off the rip and then on the bench we have brucon cookie and karen mutinous i am using the earth and armor i do realize the necklace got a little bit of a buff but the armor just feels like a better equipment all around Varden is using the chilling amulet as it's the best equipment for the character by far guy is using the bubble wand giving the murloc a plus five attack and a divine shield as well as making your other murloc attack is really great it wins you a bunch of games against caster openers and we are using the lightning rod as the main idea for brakan is to come up and just kill a protector like karen he is here with the appetizer equipment giving everyone plus nine life but as well as the synergistic aspects of the nature ramping with brucon as everything in here is nature and is using the reincarnation again synergistic with nature but just really good for speed manipulation and it helps get more kills with your murlocs earlier on hope you end up enjoying the video and if you end up liking it make sure you subscribe for more hearthstone mercenaries content check me live on twitch the link is in the description and as always you look fantastic i'm a doctor uh, so we're gonna do you you you. you will answer. All right. Let's do this. Avish. Okay. Hey, why do I always go get this comp when I'm playing Murlocs? It's so weird, but this is fine because at least I get to uh go slower. Anywho, we do this. I wonder if killing. Man, having Rag in this comp would have been really nice. I just, I literally just took him out in the first comp I go against this Varden. It's actually hilarious. This is fine. Uh, because we get the flurry off, that means Tavish isn't as threatening, which is just pretty good. Have you asked Paul what their internal testing show for how long it would take for someone to max a free to play, free to play, or character free to play? No, I'm not. I don't think you would tell me either, right? And also, there's too, there's too many factors, right? Like, there's not just like time wise, because you have to consider like how much time someone's putting into this and so on and so forth right there's more there's more to the game than just like oh dead we probably have to start killing tavish though tavish is going to become somewhat of an issue it's really hard to answer that question like i, I i'm not trying to be like sarcastic or anything like it really is because it's hard because it's like how much how much is the person willing to grind how much rng is there involved for the strangers um like are they lucky with coins a lot of factors right and paul's just the designer he doesn't know like the statistics behind everything i would imagine okay i probably lose this game still karen diablo just kind of ruins it it's hard like because i would imagine that the idea of yeah just play karen here and i lose her this comp i would actually this comp would be really good if i just had karen here it was so weird, dude. I was sitting down. And I just remember the first time I had an haircut. Diablo. I need to pull Karen. Okay, I kind of hope someone dies here. But I think killing uh, Diablo is probably the right thing here, dude. Okay. Well, that sucked. Wow, that was really bad. Oh, the bear got frozen. Man, I got really unlucky there. That's awful, dude. Wow, the bear got frozen too? That's depressing. Job done. I really have a better play than this. That's this is awful. That sucked. The the bear getting frozen actually matters so much in this game. It actually matters so much. It's really unfortunate. But uh, we are in a okay position. An okay position is how I describe this because I think we can kill Diablo here. Hopefully, it really matters on some bounces here, but. At least they're going to be slowed for next turn. And then we pull out Cookie and then we have maybe enough. Okay, it's going to be rough. Maybe we can get through this. It's definitely, it's definitely not good. When the stranger is determined, it's fundamentally useless to know. What do you mean by that? How is it predetermined?
Are you kidding? Pog. <laughs> Poggers. That's how I describe that. It just does this because this makes the best play for next turn, I think. Takes 12. He doesn't die to Cookie, which is the most important aspect of this. He's going to get six life. This is fine. Karen's also going to get life back from uh, attacking first because he does get to attack first, which is really nice. Uh, Varden is currently at like eight speed for their abilities, which means this is a 50 50 to hit this. But if I can get w beat both, it's really good. But the benefit is that because I get more life. Nice. That's huge because that's double. And because I'm going against Karen Cookie and I already have Brickon scaling, we're in a really good spot. So the 50 50 between Karen and Brakant are between my Karen and their Karen matters a lot here, but I still have reincarnation up. It's just going to be unfortunate. All right, we're going to definitely bleed here. Oh, no, I get to uh, it's after, right? So this is 20 death blow. Will, death blow can proc it. So I guess I speed up here just to beat this. I also kill Varden here. I think that's actually pretty good. That means I get the guaranteed proc the following turn. Stop the slowdown. Probably the most important. Yeah, I'm good for this. I think this is correct. Ooh, definitely rough, man. Not sure if this is even correct or not, but seems like it could be really good. Oh god, dude, I'm scared. I'm really scared. I might get a chat. I actually think I'm gonna switch my streaming time. I think I'm gonna switch it till maybe later in the day. I feel like my issue with streaming right now is like I get up and I'm just not awake enough to be entertaining. Yeah, it's unfortunate though. Oh, he went for the flurry. Oh no, that's not good. Okay. So speeding up doesn't do anything here. Great. I gotta do this, I think. They stomped last turn. This does this does a lot of damage though. Okay. This does 16 damage, so it's pretty good. They still have the bleed on. We'll be here for a week, so have a great Thanksgiving peace out. See you, Polish. We have a good thing, man. I think this is fine. It's really close. I'm not sure. Obviously, Brucon can't do anything here, but uh, if we get the stomp off, that means he gets the guaranteed go ahead. You could play Quest Mage and it'll be entertaining. Yeah, 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 funny, funny. What's better, Beast with Shadow or Beast with Nature? Um. Beast with shadow, beast with nature. Nature's fine. They're both fine. The problem with the good thing about shadow is that shadow is all casters, which is really nice, right? I think that makes more sense. I don't know. Is this an album you've queued? Uh, this is the Dell's album. I'm going to pass on Song and Quest today. Kermar, thanks though, dude. I'm too tired. I woke up too early today. All right, so we get this, which is really nice. And then we can do this to kill. That's this game. How about you thinking like the last late time? I don't know. I, I'm going to be honest. I have no idea. The issue I have is like, I want to spend time with my girlfriend. That's why I do it in the morning. Good. Hey, Trip Show, what's up, man? Yeah, this game's over. We won this one. This Adele album is really good. She did a good job. Yeah, this is the wins the game. I can't do anything here. Pew, pew, pew. Easy. Easy clap. All right, with the Murlocs win a game. Two, two, two. It'll be nature. I mean, nature's probably okay. We'll, we'll do it. Wish I had Jaina in against this comp, but it should be okay. We could follow up to this. Hey, can you ask Paul for a fix on the Sneed's equipment extra blade so it does not decay when he sits on bench? Don't think it's intentional. Oh, I didn't realize that was a problem. Yeah, sure. I can definitely dart to him. Killing Brakan seems pretty good, but the question is like, who are they going to bring out? I think Killing Brakan is probably the most. He's just the scariest guy here for, probably for me. I have a really big issue with Samara, but if they kill anyone here, we just pull out uh, Karen. We should be okay. Hey, Magma, what's up, man? Yeah, uh, just I, I don't know if I think they're on vacation right now, but uh, we'll see. 
No prob, it's just a chill track since you got the chill vibes, but I'll send you on this. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Thanks, Kermer. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, it's. I don't know if Paul's gonna listen. I don't know. I don't know if Paul's gonna listen to me, but it would, it'd be cool if he did. Nice. That's really good. Supercon's gone, which is great. Tomorrow slowed down. You can get the mirror entity off, but that's okay. The Skilly Boys first. Or the the taunt uh, goes first, which is really good. I guess the taunt to you there is Nicole's asleep or before she gets back sometimes. Every time can be a Yeah, I gotta I don't know. I, I just gotta figure it out. Oh god. Alright, I gotta kill if I can kill Samara here, I'm in a really good position. They have Diablo coming, but that's okay. I need to make sure this dude dies. And I think he's guaranteed to die. It's like a fi it, it is kind of like a 50 50 here for who gets to go first. If I can kill Samara, we're in a really good position. Be good. Just getting to Mercs with the best starter comp. Uh, starter comp? Something with Samara. I'm not sure. It's been a while. Like, it depends what you want for P. You want PvP or PvE, I guess, is the other really important question here. Oh, he gets to go first. I forgot about that. Hey, he still lives, though. Barely. Okay. So I would pull up Rukan here, but like, I think it's D. I think it's Karen. Next, I focus Balfurion down. So it's probably Karen. Because he just used Whirling Blades, which means uh, this dies no matter what. Then it's a 50 50 on who gets to go first. Oh, I guess he could speed up. If he speeds up, it's fine. If he speeds up, I kind of want the big boy, but then it's an extra guy for his dude to kill. So it's probably just send it out at Karen. I mean, technically speaking, I would like to set it here, but yeah, it's probably going to be this. But the the good news is like if they kill Varden and or Murkai here, like we're in a really good position just to wipe their board. And then we're probably going to win the game from this position because they'll be slowed down for next turn, which is really important. Samaro carry out Zyrella. It's probably fine. Uh, it depends what you want to like. If you're asking for, are you asking for PVP or PVE though? Is the question. Okay. Sure. Well, the healing. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know about the healing there, if I'm being honest. Do 31 damage. 31 damage. I kind of have to kill him before he speeds up, right? So I think this goes here. Then we do this. This leaves him up for the next one. We have taunts. It's probably the best turn I got. That way they can't just pull out Diablo the following turn. Yeah, I gotta just watch out for Diablo. Diablo's the scariest guy here. Um, we should beat Malfurion, right? Yeah. This should be okay. Oh, I didn't swing with oh no, I, I did the speed up. We did the speed up. Okay. Yeah, so he dies. Uh we slow down here. And then if I get to kill anyone here, it's you. Karen's actually pretty good to kill because Valfurion's not that scary. He is also not that fast right now. He will die, right? He gets this. He, did he, st he didn't stomp last turn. So if he wants to stomp, he can go for it. But it's not the greatest thing on the planet. This is probably okay. Oh, they're rooting. Okay. Okay, so this is not the worst thing in the world, but the problem with their play is that I get to go first because we have Samaro and they didn't Scenarian Surge. No, we don't have Samaro, sorry. We have um, Varden, which means I always get to go first, which means this speed up matters a lot, which means you're dead. And this should also mean that they're dead. But just in case we slow down again. Slow down, slow down. Yeah. I guess he could do if he if he 50 50s the doom charge here, then we're in a really bad spot. Like, I guess that's the only thing that really makes a difference here. But if they're going for doom charge here, I don't think they went. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Yo, bro, there's no way that was correct. Yo, dude. Dude, there's no way. 
Okay. I mean, the thing with the Doom Charge is that he could only focus Brukan or he could focus Karen, right? He couldn't get both. And no matter which one he focused on, he got punished. So, all good. We're going for the Murloc opener. This is the Murloc opener. That's what this is. I hope it's like Shadow or something, but I don't think it is. Oh. It's fine. Job's done. I don't think they die, but it gets severely low. It, it could be lethal. It doesn't really matter. I just want to kill Varn off the board. The faster you get Varn off the board in this like particular instance is good. The problem I'm going to have, though, is I don't really have a great way of dealing with Sour Fang and or uh, Tavish. So this will be cool. Hey, CLW, what's up, man? Be interesting. See how this goes. We still get to go first. Nice. That was the best hit. That was actually the best hit by far. Woo! Do you think the new Mercs will release for the next, next expansion? Yes, no, probably not. I would imagine that the... Oh, this is going to be Karen for sure. Yeah. No, I don't think they will. They're going to stomp here. All right, I want to hit Tavish here. Because then he'll kill the he'll do this. Be the scaly boy just to save some life. Doesn't matter. I want this to actually get proc though. He's gonna go. I, I'd be. I guess he could go explosive into this. Yeah, that's quite fun. I'm not sure if this is gonna be good though. Because I like the taunt though because it's just less damage. Health on the scaly boy. It's fine. I didn't realize they were so excited to do that because this actually isn't that good for them. I guess they could technically kill this, but they don't really. And then I followed up with mine. Okay, we should be all right. Do you have deck cards coming to Mercs? Uh, I don't know if they're ever going to do deck codes. I would be kind of surprised if they did, if I'm just being honest, but maybe. This is 20. So in this case, I probably want to hit a uh, Sour Fang. This is dead, right? Kind of want him to die, though. Job's done. Seven more days until I allow myself to listen to Christmas thing. What are you going to listen to, Zeddy? This is fine. I, I think I focus Sourfang over. I don't know. He'll be slow, so if they do end up killing someone here, it's not the worst in the world. Oh, yo, that's that's that was attractive. That was actually very attractive. I'll pull Brickon out next turn. You get the free healing on this, which is really good. So Murkai is dead no matter what here, I would imagine, because I'm pretty confident they're going to go for the uh, slowdown here, right? So this happens no matter what we want to make sure we just do as much damage as humanly possible to this individual here so i'm just going to do this just the most i can do i guess technically he's actually not dead but then no no he he, he will die right well i guess it depends on what diablo does this turn he could doom charge we both have he has cookie on the bench and i have brukan we need to just make sure Tavish dies here and Tavish is dying guaranteed. There's no way I can. Is there any way I can kill Karen? There's 31, 31 plus 31. Hold on. Could I kill Karen here? Put him to 39. I could kill Karen, but then I leave explosive up. I don't think Karen's the important here. I think it's okay. I'd rather just kill the Tavish. I don't want to get don't want to give an explosive over. Oh, yeah, this is actually really good. Okay, this is actually insanely good for me. 
Actually, is it? I don't know if it is. Because <laughs> now they get to play Cookie. Actually, this is really bad. Because Cookie got to attack. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wait, this is garbage. I could win this. I believe. We just slow down this turn. Do nothing else. Yeah. This game. Oh, it's not game, but yeah. Oh, the fish. Oh, God. I forgot about the fish. Okay, I gotta hope this Brakan bounce kills, or at least my Karen kills their Brakan. But if it bounces twice, that means he's dead. He doesn't get the actual damage off, and that's pretty important. Okay. Oh, this is close. The thumbnail is great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Nice. I have to win the 50 50 here, right? Doesn't actually matter though, because they're they're still going first. Yeah, we're fucked. Um, yeah, it doesn't matter. I just lose. Okay. Yeah. Tried.